I ordered something. You look pretty thin. What are you talking about? Thank you, brother. I've been working hard on it. Have I lost a little weight? Come on. I can't I tell. You got black on. It makes you look big. <laughs> it makes me look big, too. I look like Billie Eilish. <laughs> minus the titties. <laughs> Yep. It's another episode of Significant Brothers, the number one podcast in the number one stratosphere for solar panels. Um, please rate, like, and subscribe to the podcast. Make us as popular or unpopular as you would like. And we're back. Um I was telling Jack before, because bonus season's coming up, knock on wood, hopefully. Um, I've been working. I've been a very good boy this year. So I was hoping that I get a pretty good bonus. And I said to Jack before I did the calculations that I would give him one one hundredth of my bonus. Yeah, no takesy backsies. I thought about it. Uh, I am not doing that. It's a lot of money, like 600 bucks. And <laughs> you think I'm getting a $60,000 bonus? That's a pretty good bonus if you tell me. So wait, damn. Yeah, yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So I just want to give you like 60 bucks? I said I'm giving him one one thousandth. No, you said one one hundredth. No, but I'm switching it to one one thousandth. You're going to give him 50 cents. What? If I, if it was a $60,000 bonus and I was giving him one one thousandth, that's 60 bucks. It's nothing to sneeze at, bro. That's on top but of But you're money. not getting 60,000. You just... Well, it's after tax, too. That's on top of the money that his cousin owes me. Ooh, ooh. ooh yeah. gotta but I'll give, you, I'll give you one ten thousandth. <laughs> one ten thousandth? What are you going to give me? A fucking... Jack's getting one one... Laffy taffy? <laughs> Jack in, <laughs> I promise after taxes you owe Abby money. <laughs> after taxes, Jack will be getting one one thousandth of my bonus, and Landro, you are getting one ten thousandth for I'm all your hard work this year. With that, <laughs> yeah, give me four point three billion dollars. I'll take the one one hundred. What would you do if this whole time, right? I get the bonus right, and I write you a check for one uh, one thousandth or ten thousand, ten thousandth. One ten thousandth, and you still get like a forty thousand dollar check in the mail. <laughs> You're like, holy fuck, that dude called, does well. It's called ask no questions. I wouldn't <laughs> even think twice. I wouldn't be like, how much does Abby make? Nope, I'm not even doing the math. Wait, what's one? Ten thousand. It's like forty million dollars. <laughs> You're divided by bonus. sixty thousand. If I wrote you a sixty thousand dollar check, yeah, it's Whoa. like one point six. <laughs> Trillion dollars. <laughs> that's one point six billion dollars. <laughs> <laughs> what? That's one hell of a bonus. Fuck. What was Abby doing? Yeah. Sucking and sucking Elon Musk's dick. Yeah. I would. Oh, I would. I would rip that cock. A billion dollars. Yeah. What is the most you would do f- to for Elon Musk to give you a billion dollars? The most I would do. Yeah. There, there isn't much under the sun I wouldn't do. You would suck his dick for a billion. Oh, oh I'd suck that dry, money. bro. He Weekly, he won't have a dick after I'm done with it. Yeah, <laughs> it'd be, be gone. Dyson, that like, a, like a pencil sharpener. I would, it would be. He would be decent. You to know, the eraser. Okay, this is how. This is how hard <laughs> like I would a suck nub. his dick. Yeah, sharper. <laughs> Do you that. know when people when when Jimmy Fallon almost lost his finger because he got de-sleeved? That's what I would do to his dick <laughs> with my mouth. <laughs> I would de-sleeve his would cock. Like. <laughs> I'd just take the whole thing. Fuck it. Keep it for for a fucking. Put it in a jar. This got me a billion dollars. This motherfucker's dick. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Standard is set. I'd piss on him. I'd do whatever he wants. I'd dress up like a girl. You billion dollars. Him. Oh, I'd love to just like. I'd love to get physical with Elon. Just want like, to. Abby would want to <laughs> tie him up by the arms and use him as a bun- a punching bag. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be like the Rocky Balboa, like in the meat market. Slab of meat. <laughs> yeah. And at the end His of it, pale white body. And at the end of it all, he gives you a billion dollars. That's a steal, if you ask me. So, um, oh. Yes. Inflation. <laughs> Inflation's been really eating me up, Biden. Has it? I ordered something. You look pretty thin. What are you talking about? Thank you, brother. I've been working hard on it. Have I lost a little weight? Come on. I can't I tell. You got black on. It makes you look big. <laughs> it makes me look big, too. I look like Billie Eilish. <laughs> minus the titties. <laughs> That's the byline of this episode. <laughs> She's of age. <laughs> no. How old is she? Billy Eilish? Yeah. Like 1920? Oh, that's a little... Bad little. Bobby thinks everyone who subscribed to her OnlyFans when she, on her 18th birthday should be in prison. Man, fuck that dumb bitch. The fuck? <laughs> the oh, pay- someone signed up. <laughs> someone signed up. <laughs> nah, <laughs> but fuck. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Like, she's saying that like after the fact, right? But it's like, you made a... You, $2 million? Amanda has talked make, about she this. She made $2 million. You know, million you know that sexy little girl? 
Well, not what? sexy. Oh, I know who you're talking about. The little girl, the eight year old. She like, has that show, but she's really 25. Oh, she's yeah, like, yeah, yeah. The and bitch who wanted to drink. The out article of the... where her 31 year old boyfriend. I thought he was like, like 25. I shouldn't, I shouldn't be considered a creep for dating this girl. Yes, you should, brother. She looks like a child. I want to say, n- I want to s- agree with him just for the fact that that's what she wants. Right. right, she would never be able to have a normal life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so you got to comprehend. Like, what are you gonna do? Find another person like that? Now you got two kid-looking motherfuckers. Is fucking? she allowed to be a pedophile? Come on, no. Come on, you're no. born with that disease. Because it comes. It comes that's scary. That's, that's even like, more. That's than like a, a mental pedophile. disability. Yeah. That's like that dumb little bitch who got adopted, and she was like four. Shiloh? Years. No, that dumb little bitch who Shiloh got adopted. Pitt? She was Ukrainian or something, and she had pubes, and she was old as fuck. They made a movie based on it. The Orphan. You ever see that movie? Orphan? Annie? <laughs> orphan, motherfucker. You ever see that no. movie? The That's a big horror movie. Come out yeah, it actually happened. Row. Where these the, this family went to Europe, adopted a little girl. Yeah, I heard, I've actually heard this story. And then the, the saying that she, she was, was like, like 33. Where do We've pubes, talked about this where do on the pubes come into this? That, they, they were giving her a bath. Like you do for a fucking baby. And she had full pubes. And they were like, what the fuck? Wait, so does the girl who looks eight but is 23, do you think she has Is that care? sexual assault? What? If you are bathing what you believe is a child, but it's actually a grown ass woman. Because if it's a baby, you have to you have to wash in the crotch uh, area. You have to. Ooh. So is that sexual assault? Is she liking it low key? These are the questions we must answer. <laughs> Dirty kinky bitch. We can hook her up with Hasbula. Hasbula should never meet a woman. <laughs> that person <laughs> is too far gone. Uh that girl who looks a little like There's yeah, guys. she could fuck Hasbula. They're no. perfect for each other. That girl looks like a Polly Pocket or something. You can see her as an adult, but she got shrunk into kid size, right? She doesn't look like a kid 100%, I would say. But definitely, if you're trying to fuck that, you you definitely are in the same vein as a pedophile. You like definitely like are, so are attracted to your creep. Barbies. Yeah, He's a creep. He's a creep, but listen, listen. That's so much baggage. But listen, like walking around with her and then making out with her at the movie theater. Nah, that's crazy as fuck. <laughs> Don't do that, bro. You, you gotta like, get your ass you beat. Like pick her up and you just have to. <laughs> yeah, you gotta get your ass beat, and then you can't even blame the guy. You can't blame the guy. You can't blame the guy. That's crazy. Whoever beat your ass after you did some crazy shit like that. But what I'm saying is, it, as does long, suck. it sucks for him. As long as he yeah, is, why would he do this to himself? Because he likes he's her. He likes her. Perv. And he, he might be a clout chaser. Honestly, that's an mm. easy into a TV show. He, yeah, thinks he's, he thinks he's Scott Disick or whatever the fuck his name also is. Also, probably the f- he probably has a smaller penis, and she's probably And that's like, perfect. Yes. That's a match made in heaven. <laughs> yeah. I can't see that little bitch uh, having sex, though. That's crazy as fuck. Because it's, like it's not like she's a little person with, like, the... the, the, the like, like, the proportions. A, a little person typically has the torso of a grown woman, but it has smaller... They have smaller limbs. Are you limbs. explaining? <laughs> like, we've never seen a little person Are before. you short-splaining? No, but, uh, but what I'm saying is a little person... Is different than what she is. Mm-hmm. She's like a We're, kid. Like she has longer arms than a little person would have. Yeah, she's proportional to. It's a little like, strange. To an, to, yeah, to a Sucked young up. kid. She, she deserves to get dig down. Fuck it. As long as she's not with a crazy black guy or some shit, you can see his dick print and it's like down to his kneecap. Dude, you that'd be insane. Right. She's right. Honestly, she's spinning around his dick you, like a stripper. I. If a black guy was fucking her, then everyone wouldn't be up in arms about it. And there's not cancel they culture. Would. No, but it would be like ah, uh, you know, brother's got a kink. No, I feel like they would be worse about Just a, it. Yeah, really? Yeah, yeah, you yeah. think yeah. so? Not worse, yeah. I think a black guy could pull off fucking a little kid. Fuck no. <laughs> a little kid? <laughs> I mean, Hell no. I mean, a little kid that's really an adult. If it's a porn. You never... Were there ever a brother on Hanson? Hanson? Oh, both I both you meant, the band. I thought you meant the band. <laughs> it's because a brother Bob. a brother isn't looking for these dirty hoes in a chat room. Well, uh, pussy licking. Uh, who's the guy? Who's the... The booty warrior? Who's the Eagles guy? He was a pedophile. Eagles guy. The, oh, Ke- R. Kelly. No, the guy who used to do the Eagles rants. Oh, I don't know what you're talking the about. With the beady eyes. Saying, oh, yes. yeah, I know you're yes. talking about. R. Kelly is, though. He pisses on little girls. I want to piss on you. Child predators trip, coming trip, trip, to trip. a town near you. What if we... Imagine imagine those calls that Abby just took. EDP, eat that pussy, 445. Mm. That was calls that Abby just took. Never heard that. We're like single-handedly, <laughs> we just started taking down like a ch- uh, sex trafficking It room. felt like that, didn't it? Mm-hmm. Whenever right. they hang up the phone like abruptly, they're either getting beaten for wasting their phone minutes or we're on to something. Right now, they just called the oh, FBI there's so many missing kids over in, to fucking in, Florida. Have you been following this? There's so many missing kids in South Dakota. KB t- was talking about on the act. The fuck, might be a skinwalker. 
What? Skinwalker? What is that? You know what that is. Oh, you didn't go to Utah with us that year, did you? Oh, yes. That's the only way to know. A skinwalker is a Native American shaman that has gone to the dark side. Essentially. That's the easiest way I can say it. And you, so Daisy's you somehow gained the ability to take the form of animals. And so all these little kids and even mentioning girls? it, even mentioning it in Native American culture is like very bad luck. Like you're asking for oh, it. You're fucked. And they have videos online where this motherfucking thing is like coming up like so it looks human, but it sort of doesn't. You know, have you ever heard of uncan the uncanny valley? Uh, yeah. It's like as you get closer to humanity, it gets a little it gets uncomfortable. It's like that. This motherfucker sprinting behind. Nearly the, thirty the truck. missing persons reported in South Dakota since just New Year's Day. That's a f what the fuck? What day is it? The twenty fifth. So that means every day a kid's getting disappeared. Thir Bro. All right, here's the people: age thirteen, age fifteen, age sixteen, age sixteen, age fourteen, age twenty nine, age fifteen, age thirteen, age thirty seven. How the fuck? Seventeen, fifteen, isn't the entire nine, twenty six, forty five, seventeen. 33, 16, and they're all from indigenous How tribes. many people? There's a lot of like indigenous missing people. Skinwalker, I'm telling you. Indigenous people too, he said. I'm not surprised. Nah, but they've always had issues like that about missing people in Native American fucking... Yeah. Reported missing by the Sioux Falls Police Department. Those reported missing by the Pennington Police uh, Department. By Sioux Falls. By Ridge Ohala Sioux Tribal Police. That's kind of terrifying. Something's wrong with these motherfucking police What's forces. What's happening? And how, you're right, how is this not a bigger story? That would be breaking news. If that was in New Jersey. And then they were white. In New York, like 30 kids in Manhattan have disappeared, bro. Yeah. That shit would be helicopters, fucking crazy shit looking. How the fuck do 30 kids disappear and nothing is said? How do you even get close to 30? <laughs> 10 would be like, holy shit. Yeah. I That's agree. like a movie. That's that like, one this motherfucker's lying. The police department says Clemens says child abductions are rare. No, the fuck they're not. Third one a day. That's rare. Rare in 2022. Yeah, back in 1984, there used to be five kids. But also, every day. when I typed in South Dakota missing kids, there's an article from 2021. In the last tw 27 days, 24 kids in South Dakota have gone missing. How, uh, what is going on is in South Dakota? How are there people left in South Dakota? This is a ritual going on right now. How the fuck? That many kids? On S South Dakota's missing person list, 73 kids in total. 24 have gone missing of May 1st. This was in 2021. What? This is the national pandemic. And, like, nobody's talking about this. And the fact that we're talking about it means these phone calls, there might be a link. There might be a link. Lander, fix the what background. do you think's honestly happening? Fix the background. Oh, shit. What do you think's happening? Yeah, that's terrifying. A fucking skinwalker. I mean, that's that's all it can be. <laughs> so it, they're just people. These kids are going on like ayahuasca trips. No, not at all. You, you're just going out at a trip to take a piss somewhere, and you get caught up, <laughs> taken away. <laughs> that's all people here. Hey, Dakota, I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go take a piss over here. Are they dead? And <laughs> or trafficked? Oh, definitely dead. Trafficked. Mm, trafficked to who? You've never heard of a Native American prostitute. <laughs> Have you? You're right, I haven't. <laughs> Thank you. But good reason. <laughs> Who are they being trafficked to? Their own people? No. no it's it's out of the country, countries. yeah. Dang, you're it right. It does seem like That's that would be commodity. the area to traffic because it's right. Well, it's not right. What country do you think? Dubai? You think those people in Dubai uh, 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 do, do human trafficking? Uh, fuck yeah. All those rich Arab countries yeah. do trafficking. That's crazy. Do you think they get to see the women? I still don't understand trafficking. What do you mean? Like the commodity behind Buy and sell bodies. I get the actual concept, okay, okay? But I don't get what's so illustrious about it for these people. It's like, like why rich people it's, dabble. It's, it's like just pet. like one of those things. Like I can buy it, so a I pet. I will. It's like yeah. a pet. This bitch is my pet. I can fucking suck whatever I want. Afterwards, do they kill these people? They have to. They. Right? I mean, they run out of things to be able to afford, so they just buy humans. I know, but after they buy the humans, are they killing mm, the humans? That's they a, probably hunt them for sport. That's it. Probably, but that's a good question because it's like because then after you're done with them, it's not like they're like, all right, just going back home. Because you, as a as a person who's being enslaved, right, the best case scenario is like you become that person's like type girlfriend. But it's like they can never trust you. Like at any moment, you could kill this rich person, so they're not gonna put you in a position where you're free in any way, shape, or form. Absolutely, it's the most so I guess, terrifying. Yeah, I guess you do have to get this. I guess you're you do in have this to get this palace of. in the in Qatar, in the middle of the fucking Sahara Desert. That's not the Sahara. I'm just saying, like, you're in the middle of a desert. I'm saying you're fucked. You can't go anywhere. The cops got Lamborghinis for cars. <laughs> you're not running. 
<laughs> <laughs> they fucking found like vibranium in Sierra oh, Leone. Yeah, Did you that. see that? Like the electric charged rock. There's an electric charged rock. Yeah, Jack, explain it. Bro, you motherfuckers are gullible, I feel. No, no. What you think that's an internet? You saw Hoax? the fucking video that they had. It's shit's like circle. You remember those videos back in the day that was like, "Hi guys, I am getting a lot of if more you conne- if you connect a an out a uh, 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 iPhone cable to a watermelon and then you attach your phone to it, look, it charges. Look, look, and their video is a, a gem and then a wire and a wire, and they're like, "Look, that means it works. The light turned on." Like, you come might on, have, bro. Fucking I've been Nokia a lot- phone. Ah! I've, I've been a lot more susceptible Fuck to no. the internet. Fuck no. In the wrong way, because a lot of people are saying the M&M's thing is a Super Bowl stunt. Oh, what, what, what m and You think so? I what think are you so. talking absolutely. about? They released this whole statement saying They're that... They're stopping the spokes candies. The what? You the know boys? How, like, and the girls. And the hot green one, because of cancel culture. It's definitely a Super Bowl thing. This the bitch had heels on. Maya Rudolph. Rudolph. She had heels yeah. on, bro. What? What's so sexy about that? Oh, she has some DSLs on. on them? There's people that have heel fetishes. Yeah. I mean, some people have hand fetishes. Some people have M&M Where fetishes. Where do you stand on DeMar Hamlin being actually alive? Who? The Bills player who collapsed. People are saying that he actually died on the field, and the guy who was at the He's stadium a clone? was a stunt. Yeah. That's so fucking stupid. Uh, that's like, didn't he walk off? Didn't they bring him back to life on the on the field? No, no, no. <laughs> Shit. Maybe. Maybe. But by the time this podcast is out, we'll probably have definitive proof, even though he's definitively not a clone. But I feel like, to, yeah, today, you just can't get away with shit like that. Like, back in the day, body doubles were possible, guaranteed, before, like, you know, cell phones and shit became a thing. But today, you just can't. You can't, I you agree. know? You can get somebody that looks like you, but this man has definitely had 4K photos taken of him, 360 of a have decade of his life. Have you thought about this? I've thought about this all the time. There's no this way. It's a very morbid thing. Remember Isis John? Isis John? The guy who was beheading people, they tabbed him like Isis John in the videos, like the beheading videos. They would have the person and he'd be like, America, because you're infidels, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, a famous a journalist got captured there, right? Okay. And they wanted proof from the states. How is it actually him? And he said this like very secret thing that only he would know like with a family member. And they were like, fuck, it's actually him. Mm-hmm. What would be your secret? That you would say to them, like I always think it's got to be some corny ass line that I tell Kayla, like give me some Shugsta. It would like, be... nobody would know. Oh, now we know. Yeah, now I know, but gotta nobody would up. know that. And if I said that instantly, Kayla's like heart would sink, and she'd be like, "It's fucking Abby." I would be. It would be this. Leave me. Fuck these. And then it would be the most racist slurs <laughs> ever. <laughs> Fuck these motherfuckers. And then they blow my brains out. I'm dead anyway, bro. I'm dead anyway. What the fuck. They don't want to kill you though. They want to hold you for ransom. Nah, did that? What about the journalist? He got his head chopped off. Yeah, he's dead. Thank you. Fuck you, motherfucker! Da- I do like a guitar solo. <laughs> Welcome to the jungle. Y'all gonna like to play? Jesus Christ.